Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. I hope you guys are doing great today. I have a project share for you. I've been working with this adorable collection that I had just picked up not too long ago from Frank Garcia Studio um, online, his new paper collection, which is called Sugar Cookie. So I've made a few projects with this collection. I use um, almost like a full sheet of every sheet that's available as you know they have he has six double-sided designs and there's four sheets each so um, I did use like one sheet of each design and I just love it this collection is super adorable and also um, I had purchased a kit from Rhoda on Instagram she sells kits I will put her link down below in the description box I will try to remember to put it down below and she had the sugar cookie kit, so I purchased one as well. And that's what I used to make these projects. So let me go ahead and share with you what I made. Now, to make these, um, I used these dies to make my embellishments. So I used this die. Uh, I love it. I used the ticket, the tree, and the presents. Really cute. I used um, this one is from my creative time so I use that one I use this one as well this is from Alina Cuddle um, I will try to link these two down below in the description box if I could find links for these as well I will do the same thing these are the two dies that I used from Sizzix the um, gingerbread cookies this is from in love art shop this is like a, a tree um, a tree dye that you layer up so I use that and I also use my heartfelt creation dies so this is the dye and then I use the shaping mold as well so let me go ahead and share with you my little embellishments they came out super adorable and also I used um, in one of my embellishments I used this shimmery um, tinsel um pipe cleaner and i use this along with the fake snow to make little wreaths so cute totally inspired by mrs Evely here on youtube she's done that i think she did it last year and i just i did them i did some embellishments last year using the same technique and i just had to do it again this year i don't get tired of using it because i just love it so anyways here are my embellishments oh they're so cute okay so i did these die cuts first um i did a lot of die cuts i got some more dies here so all right let me go ahead and show so i did these die cuts this is the um, the gingerbread Okay, so I only did the snowflake, the heart, and then um, the tree, and then the two, the gingerbread man and the um, gingerbread girl. Here is cut, the, um, this is the Alina Cuddle die. So pretty. I cut it out in um, a green, mint green a glitter paper. And then um, here's the gingerbread girl, the gingerbread man. And I did not cut out the little pieces. It was just too small to cut out the little pieces. So I just used my, um, they're called liquid pearls. I use the liquid pearls. So here are the die cuts of the, of the tickets. And that's from this die right here. So I cut out the tickets. Um, I cut out the tree. Here's another one. I cut out um, the presents. I love it because it embosses as well. When you cut it, it, it embosses and it leaves a little figure, like a little design. So there it is. And then, um, yeah, I cut a lot of these out. I was just watching TV and I spent all evening after my granddaughter left with her mommy when her mommy picked her up from work after work. I just went ahead and did a whole lot of die cutting. And then um, the next day, I just uh, went to work and putting everything together. So here are some of the poinsettias, and that's using um, this die, and I use the smallest design. The picture is bigger because it's actually smaller, but oh my gosh, they're so cute. 
They came out so cute. So here's the poinsettia. And the little gold dots is actually um, these. I used these base fillers from Dollar Tree. So that's what I used here as the little um, gold balls. So adorable. I love these. So let me go ahead and share with you the embellishments I made using these um, die cuts that I did. So go ahead and put that there. Alrighty. So here it is. Now, um, here are the die cuts. I'm not sure how I'm going to embellish these trees. One of them already bent. But um, what I did with the trees, I layered them up with rose gold paper that I purchased from my, Michaels. And this is a uh, rose gold foil paper. It almost looks like copper. But um, the, the blue one came out a little bit wonky, but it's so cute. I did the pink one, and these came out much better. So these two were the first two that I made. So they came out a little bit. I was having a hard time um, gluing the glitter. I don't know. I was having a hard time. So I made those, but I'm glad they dried up really nice. Here is my gingerbread man and woman. So I used my liquid pearls, and I had such a hard time using liquid pearls. Like my dots didn't come out right. So the color of the liquid pearls that I used um, is called white opal. So that's what I used um, for the lips, the, the little arms, the little buttons. The eyes, I used little jemmies that I have in my stash. And then the bows, I put a acrylic bow for my stash as well. So that's what I did with the gingerbread. Here is the, um, the tree. The tree, I did cut out the white for the tree, like the garland. I did cut that out from the die. But the little round balls, I didn't do that. I use my Nouveau Drops. And let me tell you, I love it. I love the Nouveau Drops. I think my little um, dots came out so much better than using um, the Liquid Pearls. Now, the Nouveau Drops, these are the colors that I used. I used um, pink. I alternated. And this is Nouveau Dream Drops. They're really pretty. That's the pink one. And it's called Love Potion. And I got these from Urban Gems. So I will link her uh, store down below. That's Tara. And she's Nurse Tara um, 04, I believe, here on YouTube. Hi, Tara. So I will link her, um, her store down below. And then I also use the Crystal Drops. It's a really nice blue, um, blue color. It's called Blue Babe. So I used that one, and then I also used the crystal drops, and this is like a, it's called mint. So I use mint. So that's what I use for the drops here on the tree for the ornaments. Really pretty. Um, and then here are my, um, it's the um, star. And all I did was put the little blue um, Nouveau drops in the center, and I did a, a red heart. I mean, um... A heart cookie and then here are some some uh, peppermints um, candy canes I did it in blue mint and a darker pink I used the lighter pink on the project just like I used one of these in the project as well so those are my die cuts and then uh, Rhoda in her kit she had um, these stars two two different shaped stars and one was bigger than the other one so what I did is I layered them up now i regret that i did not um add a like dimensional dots in the back of the first layer i should have after i glued everything down i remembered oh i should have you know added dimensional tape to um to make it more thick but either way it's still dimensional it's cute i love it so here's one of them so um, I have the two stars in uh, that from the collection that she died cut. And then I used one of my little holiday tickets here. Um, I used a uh, chipboard heart, a puffy sticker from the collection. There's some tool with white dots in the background here. And then uh, here is the holly leaf from the Alina Cuddle um, die, which is this one right here that I cut out. So I just cut out a piece. So out of one of these, I was able to do 
to um to embellishments and then uh for the little berries where the berries go i just added my nuvo drops and i used the the love potion that's what i used for the little berries pink it's so cute they're so cute so here's another one i um this time i used little presents right there and this is how they look they came out so adorable i did the same thing just that just that the stickers are different and here's the one with the tree so that's how you can use those dies. Just cut them out of gold foil, you know, any foil paper or glitter paper. It will look really, really nice. And I just love how that came out. And then here's this one. So I did a chipboard piece and puffy sticker. Here's the last one. Um, here I used a Santa um, chipboard piece. And what I did is I added stickles on his hat and on his beard to make it shimmery. So I don't know if you can see that right there. It's shimmery. And then here's a little uh, red foil heart. I mean, not red foil. Rose gold foil heart right there. So I used um, rose gold paper only because the collection has rose gold foiling. So that's why I did that. So here are one of the other embellishments. They came out so adorable. And then here are um, rosettes. Now she also included rosettes. Um, in her kit so I all I had to do was just embellish so um, here is one of them so again I use this uh, netting right here and um, it comes from Hobby Lobby they might still have it um, it's the Robert Stanley collection so you find it in the fine uh, ribbon collection not in the regular craft ribbon collection and it's like netting and it's uh, shimmery so what I do is I just cut this wire off and I just used the centerpiece. So that's what I did. And I used that on all, I pretty much on all of them. I can't remember, I have, I'll, I did two of them and then the other two I think I used tool. Well anyways, um, so I have two trees. Here's one of the die cuts. Now some of um, his die cuts are, has a lot of um, a lot of the white border around. So I had to trim that off because um, I don't like to see too much white border. And then here I put another foil tree and then a little house and a snowman. Oops, excuse me. So yeah, it came out so cute. And then uh, here's this one. Here's a round rosette. And um, I put like a little, this die cut has a lot of trees. It's like three trees in a row and a, chip, and a couple of chipboard pieces. I use that netting again. And then this one, um, I use tool, really cute. And then um, I added three chipboard, four chipboard pieces. And then I put a star chipboard piece as well. It's full of, no, and this is uh, cardstock. This is the ephemera. Really, really cute. And then here's the last one I made. Um, I uh, did a cluster of three hearts, a mint pink and uh, the rose gold. And then here's ephemera and then two chipboard pieces. And this one has tool in the black background. So I love these. And then here are some I'm using as little fillers. Um, so here's some little, my little poinsettias right there. And then here is my little wreaths that I created using um, the pipe cleaners. And um, all I do is I use hot glue to, uh, to create this. And um, I make it fuller, you know, and then here's a bow that comes with the with the kit that came with the kit And then again, I use my little holly leaf with the berries and I also used um, Ribbon roses for my collection. I have this little baby blue deer in my stash. So I added that as well So these are they came out so adorable so uh, practically all of them are the same, just that they're different colors. So this one has a mint or, or baby blue um, bow. And then this one has a pink bow. So I used the pink deer, really cute. And practically did all of them the same, just different colored deers. And then here's a peach one. When I use a brown deer. And the flowers I like... It's the same flowers, only that I place them differently. And then here is um, uh, every colored one. And then this deer is a Tim Holtz deer that I have in my stash. The bows came from um, Rhoda's kit. 
so yeah so those are my embellishments i had so much fun creating these um i like to just sit sit in front of the tv while watching tv and do all the die cutting and then start playing uh playing with all the with all the die cuts and create little embellishments um once i'm done doing all the die cutting <laughs> if i made sense so yeah so i had so much fun i hope you guys enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and i hope you have a wonderful day and i'll see you next time bye